comments and notes. A little bit of confusion here as far as Excel is concerned because for years in all previous versions prior to 365 Office we had comments and this is where you could attach a little post-it note to a particular cell with a little comment in. Now Microsoft in 365 changed the name to notes so the feature is still within Excel if you're familiar with comments in previous versions it's still there but it's now known as notes. Now if we have a look in the review ribbon don't be misled by this section here comments this is a totally different feature to what we're used to this allows you to connect through your teams through your SharePoint server and it allows the comments to be shared in a kind of social media way here is the section called notes and this is what we used to use as comments now the idea behind notes is that you can click on a cell for example A6 you can choose from the drop down of notes to create a new note you click on that and it pops up a little post-it note with your name in so whichever name you use to log in it will appear at the top you can change that if you wish you can then just type a note in here for example about the north uh, we need to monitor cells for this region Now you'll notice if we click our mouse away the comment disappears but it leaves behind a little red indicator in the corner of that cell. Now a user can move their mouse over the cell and as they roll their mouse over the cell the, the note will appear. Move away it disappears. Now you can add as many as you like on here. There is an alternative way of doing this and that is by right clicking your mouse over the cell that you want to attach a note to. So right clicking over this cell B10 you'll notice down here is an option called new note. Click on that. We can type something in here. You can also format the text as you would in Excel normally. So we could highlight that, go to home, make it bold, increase the font size. You can also stretch the note to make it bigger and it disappears when you click away. Now should you want to display all of the notes you can go into review, notes, and you can show all notes. And that will display all of them on the screen. We can turn those off by going back to show all notes. Notes can be printed when you go to your print when you go to your print preview or if you go to your page setup so if we go into page layout and our page setup button you'll notice in the page setup dialog box on sheet tab 
you'll see there's an option here comments and notes and you can display them at the end of the sheet what that'll do it will print out your spreadsheet as normal and then at the very end it will place all of the comments with a reference to the cell they're from you can choose to display on the sheet in place to delete a comment you can select the cell that it's on go to review click on the drop down and you'll see that you can choose to edit the note and it brings it up so you can make changes you can delete you can edit the notes by either selecting the cell and moving to the notes in the review ribbon and choose edit note and that will put your cursor back inside to allow you to edit it alternatively you could right click over the cell that contains the note and you'll notice down here you've got an option to edit the note but also an option to delete the note and that will remove that from the sheet and that is the feature called notes formerly known as comments